Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Rambles on Record. As you can kind of tell, format's a little different than usual. I've felt like changing up a couple things recently, and uh, this episode is definitely going to be me just talking about all of those changes that I have planned, as well as giving a little update on life things. And I think the biggest thing that I want to tackle first is just why I've been gone so long. And that's mostly boiled down to I haven't felt entirely pushed to do a video on anything. And I've had a lot of I've had a lot of feelings about, you know, making reviews and whatnot. I still enjoy them, but it's a question of is this something that I want to do all the time or are there other things that I'd like to be doing instead are there other videos that I'd like to be making over this is this something that I want to be known for and I don't think that's the case I again I still enjoy doing them but it's <clears throat> Ariel matter of how long do I want to do this you know um so I'm going to still be making reviews here periodically, but don't expect as many and don't expect a lot of long ones. I say long ones because that's another thing that I wanted to talk about. I am going to be doing more shorts content as best I can because I want to be uploading daily. I want to get to a point where I can start actually doing things with this channel every single day instead of once a month because I really do want to do video it's just that again I haven't felt quite pushed to do any of it right now and I need to be pushing myself to do that kind of stuff and a big part of that problem is the mindset that I've had for such a long time regarding video being that it's better to post one big thing uh, in very few quantities rather than a bunch of small things in very large quantities but I do think there's merit in posting a bunch of smaller shorter content on a wider scale because it's it's very much so how like how uh an artist will do sketches before actually making a piece of art it's not always that they use those sketches to you know make the piece of art that they're working up to but it helps them to own their skills in the craft as well as display their talents in other areas and that's how I need to be thinking about this kind of thing. I need to be practicing on an art that I want to hone every single day. I need to be working on editing and video making every single day. I got thirsty. And this series is... Again, it's such a non-edited thing. I'm not really building those skills. I'm just kind of staying a little stagnant where I am with things, and I need to be fixing that. So expect a lot of daily content. And if there's figures that I don't have a lot to say about, that I still want to talk about really quickly, then I'll do a shorter video on them. There are other figures that I'll actually give time with a longer in-depth analysis and more full thoughts on something like that. Though I know that <clears throat> it is going to be more beneficial for me to say that some things that I have less things to talk about are better left as shorter videos. I can see the, the recording process as well now. I have to do this all the time because I I try to do this all the time because I, I have really bad uh what is it? 
I'm I'm a very gaseous person anymore. I have really bad burps. You're this is not something that I'm this on my head is not something that I've been doing the entire time I've been doing this show. This is supposed to dry out my hair as well as hold it in place so that I can try and get wavier hair because I hate curls that I have. I really should edit this, but at the same time I am I am 15 minutes away from when I should be in bed. And that's the other thing that I need to quickly talk about. That's another reason that I think as much is because I've been working. So let's quickly go over all the light things. A lot of stuff has kind of followed me whole at this point. I've needed to put a lot of focus into it over making videos. So one of the biggest things right now has been I took up more responsibilities at work and now I went from a part-time worker to a full-time worker. So I've been making more I need to and I've had a lot more responsibilities. I've been spending a lot of time going into work. I go in in the morning now as well as one day in the afternoon. This week is going to be a little weird, but that's the main schedule is I'll go in in the morning, out by the afternoon. There's one day out of the week where I go in in the afternoon and come out at, the, and come out at night. So that's, that's been something that I've been doing recently. Um, the other big things, I own a car, baby. I own a vehicular. That was a huge, huge thing that I had to get settled with my life because I needed a car. I desperately needed a car. Now that I have a car, I've been able to do a lot more. So I'm hoping to be able to do a lot more with and everything because I have the availability to go other places instead of just sitting in my room and doing things so those are those are some of the big things I own a, I own a, a car now and that is that's been one of the major things of why I've had to take focus away from this was because I had to get that whole thing situated I've been wanting to do daily content for a hot minute. I've just been nervous to do it. And I think that's another quick thing that I want to talk about is just, I think I've talked about this a couple times now, but when it comes to YouTube, you have to find a way to get anxieties with it because a lot of the anxieties has been about what other people will think and if you force yourself to if you try to think too much <clears throat> sorry if you think too much about how other people view what you want to do then you put very little value in what you want to do because you think that other people aren't going to like it and that's just not how you need to be thinking about it when it comes to art it's all about how you want to do something and art really truthfully just a subjective thing it's a personal thing people can view your art because they want to but you cannot change your art because what someone else if they want it done their way they should do it themselves but I'm I'm ready to start doing videos here soon again. They're short. I'm going to be starting off small, but I'm going to try and work up to another review here soon. I have been sitting on one for a friend for a while, and I'm staring at him right now. I need to get on that. So I think what I want to try and do is do a bunch of short short videos. Excuse me. 
do a bunch of short videos before doing one big one and taking time throughout the week to edit and refine the big one for the week. Because what I'm doing now is less of a what I'm doing now is less of a refined piece. It's more of a journal. And I think it helps me process a lot of things and especially for this one, get information out to the people that are watching the channel still, which if you're still watching the channel, thank you. I do gratefully, greatly appreciate that. But it's, but this is not quite the only thing I want to do, you know? Not every painter wants to just paint. So I'll be trying to work on stuff. I want to talk a lot about media here soon as best I can. And I, I've had ideas on how I want to manage that. How I want to work that out, but I just haven't enacted on any of it yet. I, again, have felt super motivated to do a lot of this kind of stuff. Um, I'm hoping that tomorrow I'll feel better and I'll feel ready to start actually working on things, even if it's small, so that I'm not just doing monthly uploads again. I really do want to start trying to build some kind of a following here, and I know the best way to do that is through daily uploads of things. So, expect more, expect more soon, as long as I don't chicken out again. I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I really want to make an update on. Nothing huge. Um, I want to, at some point or another, I need to make like a little short on my 3D printing stuff because I, that's something obviously, obviously, that I've I've started working on here and there. I've been doing 3D printing and amateur 3D modeling for a while, and I've wanted to kind of see if I could find anyone who would be willing to purchase the files off of anywhere. They can print them themselves and or in the future have me print them and then ship them out somewhere else. Though I don't know how comfortable I am with that quite yet, the shipping out part, because hey, this 3D printer is a low end so the quality on it isn't great but at the same time for what i'm having to do i'm going to have to charge some good prices for it i have to charge pretty pretty high for it because this is it, all the printing is time and i know that much all the printing is to paint half the stuff myself unless I get you know 3d printer filament that's in the color but that's also not the cheapest option it'd be more it'd be best in the long run still I'm probably gonna have to do that at some point anyway but you know I can't do like multicolor jobs I'd have to print it in one color and then paint the other colors on if I wanted to do two colors etc but that's that's a smaller thing if you enjoy 3D printing and you have a 3D printer of your own and be, you'd be interested in that kind of thing, let me know in the comments or whatever. Um, I'd love to hear from y'all as well. I do, I do try to read every comment that I get. I may not always respond because I'm a little social recluse, but I do read everything that everyone's. But I think that's the full update. If so, big takeaways are that I'm going to be posting daily if I can in the form of shorts, not long form content. I'm going to try and get back to streaming here soon as well. I should mention that. I have to send something where it's like a weekend stream or something. I want to start doing that again too. Content is going to be 
shorts content is probably not going to be high quality, but I'm going to try and bring quality to the other stuff that I want to that I actually want. Goes in one shorts. I'm not going to be doing fully reviews anymore. I expect changes throughout the channel, as well as uh, this this podcast. Of course, this is going to be a normal thing from now on. Expect me looking over here a lot because I'm having to recording. This this video has a normal thumbnail, the thumbnail that I've been using for a while, but I am going to be switching up to a new thumbnail for the late May recording because Anna decided to make me I asked Anna actually she didn't decide to she asked me what art to make and I told her to make a thumbnail and she did a spectacular job so I'm going to post that everywhere if you want to find her it should be Anna does art on Instagram as well um have a lot of her art anywhere. I should, I'll post it in the description as well. That, that way you can easily find it. So if you want to check out her art, she does all of the art. She did all the art for the, um, for May's SMP stuff. She's done a lot of the art for, oh, another friend of mine, just a Fuchs, who's also on the streams. I don't know if I, I don't ask her for a lot of art. Most of the time, because I don't like asking her for it, I like to have my own art. I like for my my channel to have my own stuff on it instead of just asking her to do it. Kind of weird, probably kind of weird, but it's not like it, her art is bad. It's I want to make my own art and I want my channel to have my own stuff on it. So. I'm probably just strange, but I think that's most everything. Again, works content, longer content will be, I'm not going to make any guarantees, but it should be returning soon. Um, there's another thing. I keep forgetting the other thing. New types of content, new types of content and subtle changes throughout the channel. Probably new art if I can get around to it. <laughs> but I think that's everything. This, of course, will stay as a main good way for me to journal my thoughts and my feelings, as well as again keep you guys updated throughout stuff like this. Because this is a this is a great format for me to just say, hey, here's an update. Because you know what? I just throw it up. <laughs> I throw it up on the channel. But I so I hope to have something out for y'all tomorrow and I should have something out for y'all tomorrow so expect something small but still fun I will talk to you and the thing that I what is the yes put some good in the world please and thank you <laughs>